Hi, I'm Lindsay from Lenny Penny Embroidery, and this is one of our newest fonts, Sweet Script in a Vintage Stitch. This is a native BX font, so you'll only get one BX file to install, and you can scale it to whatever size you need, and it resizes perfectly. I want to show you something else that is unique about this font. Uh, we have two options for the letter R. So when you're editing your lettering, you can select the letter, uh, the individual letter, by grabbing its green square. If you right-click, you'll see this letter has an alternate option. So the normal R doesn't have a leg here on the left, and the replacement does. So this R is perfect to use because these two letters don't connect. Let me show you this letter here, where these two letters do connect. It just helps it to fit perfectly. So that's where you would select normal, does not have a left leg, and the replacement does. And that's the difference between the two letters. Let me show you the difference between the two fonts. The top one is the bold version, and the bottom is the regular. The bottom version uh, will allow you to scale it smaller because the stitching isn't as wide. So this will work better uh, for smaller uses. So we can scale it all the way down. You can see it's still nice and legible. If we were to do that with the top, um, it's a little harder to read. So that's the difference between the two fonts. One other thing that's really neat um, about these native fonts is over here in the stitch tab you'll see this nearest point and I'll turn off the 3D so you can see it. Um, what that does is allow the software to set where each letter starts stitching and ends stitching so that they stitch continuously without any ties or jumps. So I can move this around and it'll still put it in the nearest connecting point. If I make them touching, then there won't be any stop or gap or tie between the letters. And I'll show you what happens if I turn that off. Then the software is just going to place the starts and stops wherever I have them programmed. So here you would see this little dotted line is a jump between the letters. And same here. You'll see wherever they start, wherever I set them to start and stop is what it's going to do. And that would be like if this was a regular BX font and not native, but since it's native, we can click this button and it'll take away any jumps and ties between letters. So you'll get a perfectly seamless stitch out. Which I think is pretty incredible.